many analytical processes rely on knowing the dates of specific events for example if payroll processing occurs the second friday of every month it's beneficial to know which dates in the year represent the second friday of each month using the date functions you can build dynamic date tables that automatically provide the key dates you need let us create a table to show nth occurrence of all the weekdays in a particular year for all the months enter the months 1 to 12 in column a each day in a week has a number 1 for sunday 2 for monday and so on enter them in row 1 in j5 we have the year and nth occurrence in j7 to display the header for each weekday dynamically use this formula use occurrence number from j7 and switch statement for letter suffixes enter any of the formula displayed to calculate the nth occurrence of a weekday in b3 for example enter the first formula in b3 use absolute cell reference for year and the nth occurrence for month use absolute column reference for day use absolute row reference this formula returns the date based on a given year month day and nth occurrence it returns first sunday in january 2014 copy the formula across and down we have the year as 2014 and nth occurrence as 1 the table lists the first occurrence of the all the days in the week for all the months in 2014 if you want the second occurrences just change 1 to 2 notice how the headers have also changed for year 2021 and nth occurrence you can also use this formula don't forget to use absolute reference where needed you get third sunday in january 2021 copy the formula down and across you get a list of third weekdays in 2021 for all the months to download example excel file please click on the link in the description if you like this video please subscribe to our channel